first vlog, yeah. first video log. Documenting our lives. We uh, have been meaning to do this for a while because we feel like it's a good idea to, uh, you know, get your memories on video so you can look back at them and kind of relive some of your most fun moments. And uh, it's going to be a trial and error thing, <laughs> both technically and us trying to Content. speak naturally. Yeah. And actually, that reminds me, we're going to need to cut what I'm about to say to the front of the video because the channel, if it hasn't been taken already, is going to be called Hey Future Us. So we need to start each video saying it that way. One, two, three. Hey, hey Future, Future Us. Us. Uh, we're in Martha's Vineyard, Massachusetts. That's right. And it's a beautiful sunset. We're on Lighthouse Point or something of the sort <laughs> and uh, about to go for dinner. We're going to try and cut together a whole vlog of our trip. That's right. And we hope that we like it in the future. <laughs> I actually meant to try some on this as well. I mean, I know that's gonna look better, but there's so many technical things that can go wrong when you're using a DSLR, whereas this thing, and just get it right the first time. Typically. The height difference is gonna be a problem. There. <laughs> <laughs> I got an alfalfa sprout happening yeah, right now. As do I. Oh yeah, that's the wind. Ooh. We like that. There's the vlogging setup on day one. <laughs> and Here we are. Uh, let's do it. living in Boston. We moved there about a year ago and the plan was to be there for a year while I do my fellowship but uh, plans change and now we're gonna stay because I'm gonna be working at Brigham. So a couple more years in Boston which means we get more time to explore the area around That's here. That's right, yeah. Which New is England. good because we got foiled by COVID right. for yeah. much of our exploring time. That's right, yeah. We were intending to actually be in Maine right now, but they still are not allowing out-of-state visitors. So, fortunately, we have this in our state. You are, 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 you are the solution. You are the solution. You are, 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 you are the solution. You are the solution. So we were planning to go for dinner, but this sky just keeps getting more and more ridiculous. So check it out. Couple restaurants we were thinking of going to were closed, and then we happened upon this one with this glorious table. Watch right in. 8:30 on a Sunday. Thank you, COVID. <laughs> this is pretty sweet. Also, <laughs> gas for humans and dogs. Okay, we're filled up on gas and Tritos. <laughs> and now we are heading to get the morning coffee, which is essential for our lives. Thank you so much. Wow, beautiful. So today we are heading over to the southwest part of the island. There's something called the Aquina Cliffs there, which is supposed to be a really beautiful piece of shoreline and I think some nice beaches. We have the doggo in tow today. We're going in relatively blind today. We're just going to figure it out as we go. So what is 25? That's like 50. Thank you. 
you go. Yeah, you silly goof. So we're here at Lobsterville Beach and Twigs is definitely becoming a better and better swimmer. This has been super fun to learn how to do this. Twigs is eight months old right now, almost nine. He's a huge handful. He's eating the sand. Yes. How does that sand taste right now, buddy? <laughs> nom, nom, nom. We have found seven ticks on twigs already after our recent walk. Ew, ew, ew. Is it focused? No. We don't have tweezers because we're not yet smart dog owners. So I've just been grabbing them with my fingers from their butts. This is tick number 10 or 11 that we just found on them after this walk. Always yelling at me. Tick roar. The ticks are real. Yeah. And they carry all kinds of gross Lyme disease. My mom had it a couple of years ago and she was bedridden for about a month. And uh, you can have much worse complications than that. I feel like that was the most boring tone of voice I've ever used in my life. It was just your normal voice. Lecturing. No, no ticks. So Allie's got a bunch of work to do back at the hotel tonight. So I'm getting some B-roll shots in Edgar Town, which is this beautiful, classic Cape Cod, Martha's Vineyard style of architecture. evening in Martha's Vineyard. Yeah. Going to uh, 19 Raw, what's it called? Raw 19 Oyster Bar, Ooh. if we can get a table. Yeah, we're gunning for the patio spot with yeah. the cool uh, street view. Yeah. Update on the dinner situation. <laughs> the restaurant we wanted to go to has a two and a half hour wait list on the patio. So uh, we we're gonna wait. <laughs> detoured to our nice fireplace drinks location at Atlantic. We finally made it. The wait ended up only being like 30 minutes. So we're at our awesome bar seat. We just had the most tasty dinner that we've had in like a long time. Allie is saying it's her best meal since moving to Boston. I did say that, I did say that. So, 
That's high praise. That is high praise. I'm very picky. Favorite dish? All three of the things that we ordered were amazing. Scallop crudo, Maya May beer, lobster tacos, and we had a fried octopus dish. Hot, so good. soft shell lobster taco. Mind blowing. Really, really good. Uh, say it on three. One, two, three, pause, say it. All right. Okay. One, two, three. Hey, future, hey, future. us. No, you pause for <laughs> one second. <laughs> hey. I got excited. One, two, three, pause. Okay, hey, okay, okay. I got us. it. I got it. I got it. One, two, three. <laughs>